Hey everyone, my name is Kyle. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fantastic day. So today's video, I'm going to react to episode 3 of Miss Marvel. Really, really excited to see what happens in this episode. Uh, because the episode 2's like cliffhanger was really intense. I'm like, OMG, like who was that? Da -da 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 -da. And we're going to obviously find out in this episode, so I'm looking forward to watching it. And before we get started with this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification button, and follow me on my social media. See the link in the description box down below. And if you're interested in supporting the channel and wanted to watch my full length reactions, you can go over to my Patreon. The link for my Patreon is linked in the description box down below. And on my Patreon, as well as with the full length reactions, I'm kind of creating a Discord server where everyone kind of communicate together and we talk just more about Marvel and stuff and we just get to interact and, and be part of the community that I'm trying to build over there and be part of the stencil family and yeah I'll, um look forward to seeing you over there and yeah without our further ado let's get right into this video british occupied india in 1942 Korea, Celine, i found it oh the bangle. I found the bangle now the real question is how did they just randomly sent this to kamala's family oh no get out of there go aisha we don't know what just one bag we will do. Gonna have to find out! <laughs> what? I'll choose one. Oh, then we've never seen her again. <laughs> that was the last time. Oh, that's Namsha. So, how did you all um, say you knew her? Was it like, did you guys meet in school or something? Not mm. exactly. Aisha was from another dimension. Oh! And so are we. The multiverse. No, of course, yeah. We're not here by choice. You were exiled. What? And exiled? just when we got close to finding our way home, we were separated. You're right. She is adorable. Aww. I, I, I never said that. <laughs> got embarrassed. This is so awkward for you. <laughs> <laughs> that is awkward now. We didn't even know she had any. Until you put on that bangle and we sense the presence of Noor. Oh. There's Noor within us as well. It slows down our aging for one thing. Oh, okay. But we can't access its full potential in this dimension. Zaisha's wish to bring us all home. And now you must finish what she started. Oh, okay. So where exactly is your home? And also, what are you? Like... Respectfully, like, what are we? <laughs> Everything's a lot right now. The Noor dimension, we're known as clandestines, but what we're most commonly known as is Jin. Oh, okay. This is a lot now. The story is getting a lot more complex. I'm a Jin. And tonic? <laughs> no. Uh, Jin and tonic. I know what I am, and it's not as guardian or alien. Do you know anything about interdimensional travel off the top of your head? Specifically that of the Nord dimension. That's N O O. Actually, no, that reminds me of a paper I read. Uh, I think it's by Dr. Eric Selvig. Perfect. Oh, oh Eric Selvig! Really no way. Stuff at the menu. They're relating it back to him. Um, That's cool. Okay. From back from like Avengers it's One. Funny. Oh, the D O D C. What's the D O D C in WandaVision? Fan out type supremacist. Uh, not without our permission, you all. Oh! Return when you have a signed warrant. Excuse uh -huh. me, Miss Agent. Next time, remove your shoes. Ooh. <laughs> or did you just say you won? Maybe. Yay! Dude, bro. I'm so happy for her. Do you agree with everyone about our new masked neighbor? Good. It's not a thing you are, Kamala. It is a thing you do. Love the quote. Love that. She just has to prove everyone wrong. That's cool. I built her a mask. Aww. He's so cute. Oh my goodness. It's just something for cultural studies class. The gin? The gin? Yeah. Please come on. Oh no. Supernatural beings of pre Islamic folklore, the gin, have had many names across 
time and cultures. Some call them genies, others demons. Legend tells of a group of hidden jinn, exiled from their home world and damned to live out their days trapped in our own, searching for the key that will help them get home. I can't be the superhero. Why did she keep telling herself that? She can be a superhero if she wanted to. She has the bangle. Ahmed is getting married. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh? Who would have thought that would happen? <laughs> Who would have thought that would happen? <laughs> I feel like something's gonna go down on this wedding. <laughs> like All the money I have in my checking account. $732. And 49 cents. I'm surprised you have that much. <laughs> wow. Uh, well, now's not the time. You are now husband and wife. Yay. I was going to tell you, she just needs some more time. We don't have more time. But apparently it might be dangerous if we don't do it right. Of course it's dangerous. Why wouldn't it be? Oh. <laughs> you, you knew. And you still asked Kamala to do it anyway? This place will never be our home. We're going to make her help us. Oh shit. I'm not asking anymore. Wow. So are they not even the good guys either? Oh no. Yes. Work it. <laughs> I gotta crash this no, wedding no, no, no. here. <gasps> They're just gonna take her. Entire family, I've come here to warn you. <laughs> what? You're not safe. None of you are safe. What? Kamala, they're coming after they you. They were so nice to me. Can I? I'll just go talk to them, okay? They're okay. not here to talk. They'll kill everyone. You have to get out of here. Hey. The Jen are gonna kill everyone? You should leave. Kamala, everyone will die. He almost sticks to the classics, right? Yeah. Oh. Oh shit. So I guess the bad guys are the gens. Behind you, behind you, behind you! Oh shit! Uh oh, uh oh. This is a, such an unfair fight. Especially when Kamala doesn't know you know how to use half her powers. Oh shit. <laughs> Bruno! Oh! Oh yes! <laughs> yes! Kamala! Oh, Cameron's gonna help us! Okay. Oh no, Cameron! Get right out of here! Oh, I swear it gets my name wrong on purpose. <laughs> <gasps> no! Don't throw him off the edge! Oh! No! The Cameron just died? Why should I protect those who betray me? What? Oh shit! Oh my goodness! Ride Kamala and Bruno! Kamala? Not yet! What was that? He's gonna find out that she has powers. This whole time it was you and you didn't say anything? Well, come on, you have to go. They're after you. Just wait. No, just no, wait. no, just no, wait. no, no, no. Just wait! Just knock in, we'll take care of you. Wait, no! Just go. I'm gonna explain everything later, I swear. Did you pull the alarm? Who were those people you were with? They were arrested. Can you tell us what exactly happened? <gasps> no. I can't. Okay. That was so weird. We thought that the gen would be with us, but they're not. Hi, Nani. Um, Hello, Kamala. Can I call you later? You need to come to Karachi. What? I mean, when didn't even let me go. Oh, you both need to come. Did you see it? See what? 
Did you see the train, beta? Yeah. How did you know about that? Because I saw it too, which is oh. why you have to come. Oh. You have to come to Karachi. Yeah, that was episode three of Miss Marvel. That was really, really intense, y'all. Like, at first it was like, I mean, I felt like the plot was, it's starting to build up and stuff. And then the, it just got really intense, this episode. Like, we thought the, um, the Bruno's mom and him rescuing Kamala from the agents of DODC. Okay, they're on our side, whatever. But no, they end up being Jin and Cameron's mom worked alongside with um, Aisha. And then when they found the bangle, they, they split apart because I guess maybe the British army was looking for that. And then, um, and then they never tried to reconnect again. But then I guess they're all part of the Jinn and got exiled from their timeline. And they want to go back, but in order to do that, they have to use base the power of the sun to open a portal for them to leave. So then they try to making, like, convincing Kamala that she would be um, the one that would... Well, they convinced Kamala to be like, oh, I'm on, we're on your side, we'll be here for you, blah, blah, blah. But then it ended up being actually the bad, some of the bad guys of it, which is insane. And uh, we're just only trying to use Kamala. And that threw me for a loop. I was like, another plot twist. OMG. And then the DODC came in. They arrested the Jin people. But I feel like the Jin are going to escape. But then when Cameron's mom touched the bangle, they both saw this train coming at them. And then Nani also saw it. So it's like, what the hell is happening right now? Like, <laughs> um, it almost seems like there's kind of like two different bad guys. I feel like it's like the Jin and then, um, especially the mom and then, uh, Agent Clearly and DODC. So there's about two different factions, like, or groups of people coming af com after Kamala. But like, I feel bad for Kamala because it's like, like she obviously wants to be a superhero, but now it's like getting super real. And I'm not sure if she really wants to be it anymore like it's an, a good thought but then when it actually happens you're like i don't know if this is really like for me or anything like that um so that was interesting and so i'm curious to see what's gonna happen but now kamala has to like move or go see nani so i don't know how she's gonna convince her parents because she can't tell the parents that she has these powers because i think something will happen or they'll take it away or like or she, or they get worried about her. So Kamala's like, you'll just find out later. But I hope Nikita's not mad at Kamala because there was a scene there when Kamala's gonna tell her, but then she did not tell her because Nikita was hinting that they that she won the election. So then that kind of just was overtaking the conversation, and then she didn't. was like, oh, I'll just tell you later. But then she didn't end up telling until she sees Kamala blast this cosmic thing out of her arms and then she sees it and she's like wait you're the girl you're nightlight and then kind of got mad for not telling her which i kind of understand but you want to keep it a little bit secret kind of thing so super super hype but yeah this kind of wraps up my reaction to episode three of miss marvel i'm looking forward to episode four it's getting really good now this series yeah, I look forward to hearing your comments about this episode as well. Did you like it? Did you not like it? And I'll see you in the next video. Peace out. Bye.